Yo, what is going on guys? Mosey back here with another video and today I will be covering Hunt Showdown. If you don't know what's been going on with this game, you can look back at my video where I covered the February 15th patch notes. Some of you may see that I have not uploaded much of the Hunt lately and that's because of these changes which I will be diving into deeper in just a second. So for starters, you can see that my playstyle has completely changed. With the whole bloodline reset more than once and the buff to every AI, it's not possible to go around ignoring audio cues like I used to. In some of my other videos, you can see me just running around with a sword and elephant rifles, and we just didn't care about anything except killing other players, downing the boss in like 10 seconds, and then bouncing with the bounty. But you can't do that anymore, because with this new update, armored zombies are now faster and tougher, which means you can unload at least four shotgun shells into a armored and he'll just get right back up and start chasing you. And then hives have a higher activation radius and double the damage with their swarm, which forces you to ignore them most of the time. Before I could just charge at them with the sword and kill them before they noticed me, but now if I even run near them, the hive gets sent out, uh, the swarm gets sent out, and if it hits you, you get double damage from the swarm. So you're not only losing bars of health, then you on top of that, you also have the poison damage. All of this combined forces you to have a much slower playstyle. Before this update, hunters were the largest problem of each lobby. Now the roles are kind of switched. If you activate any audio cue around the map, you're bound to get a horde of zombies just chasing you. And then you'll be stuck running from a horde of zombies, and then if a player sees you, you know, it's game over right there. If you're lucky enough to make it to the boss, the boss fights have also been buffed. The spider now has increased health and range with her poison throw, and the butcher has increased accuracy and damage. These factors combined make hunt so much harder to make it out of alive with your hunter, which isn't necessarily a bad thing because that's the way the game is supposed to be, but this makes providing quality entertainment from playing this game so much harder because every game we go in with a new hunter who has no health, no weapons, no perks, and it's not easy to get them out alive and to level up so we can't show off all the higher tier weapons or any of the higher tier perks. Each game consists of about 20 minutes of crouch walking with only one or two teams to fight if you're lucky and then <laughs> killing the buffed bosses with low level guns. It's just really rough right now. Keep in mind that this game is just an alpha so the qualities aren't permanent, but it will take some time and leveling until I can provide some quality content on this game. You know, it's really not going to be that much fun to watch Jack streaming us crouching around a map, either getting kicked from a game or other players, and then recording 30 minutes of me walking around just for one minute of a short gunfight where either a zombie finishes off someone or someone burns another player to death. Basically that just covers everything I wanted to talk about and just wanted to catch y'all up with the hunt and what's going on. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I'm trying to get better at commentaries but I'm not a very fluent talker so these types of videos will improve over time. I just gotta practice more. So uh, be sure to leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed this. Subscribe for more hunt content and I will see you on the next video.